hello guys not so smartphones here and today i'm going to be showing you how to optimize your iphone ipod touch and ipad device first of all this tutorial isn't really for beginners but if you have a basic know-how of cydia then this tutorial is for you make sure you add this source then search and install dylib disabler what it does is to allow you to see what mobile substrate tweaks are running in the background one example is SB settings. SB settings allows you to click on toggles, for example, a shortcut to a Bluetooth or Wi Fi setting. It can also be used to figure out how much RAM is available. Like computers, the more tweaks running simultaneously on a device, the slower your device becomes. But how do you clean up your device? By disabling daemons? By using iCleaner? From experience, those apps have their uses but in the first place there is nothing really wrong with your device I've noticed that the problem is with Cydia itself some apps in Cydia require other apps components in order to work for example SP settings which needs activator to work but you will notice that once you've uninstalled SB settings activator stays and this is the same for many other applications that's where DYLib Disabler comes in. It won't tell you what apps that are unnecessary, but it will show you the processes that are running in the background. It's now up to the user to pick out the individual processes. In the app, you can disable the individual app or delete it, but I do recommend you to be careful and not delete any process. Only disable it to see how they affect the device. If you have done a fresh jailbreak, you should have two or more processes. If you see more, then, then those are probably tweaks. To remove them, simply visit Cydia and search for it in the packages section. Tap on remove, then read the apps associated with it. If you know the app, then delete it. If not, leave it. Better safe than sorry. If you get good at recognizing the apps that don't belong, you will see a faster and smoother device. I'll keep a link in the description to show you the processes that you should and shouldn't remove. For more, please like, share and subscribe.